Hello, y'all. Good morning. I don't know if I like this feel to y'all. Why does y'all make me have like a little fat little dumpling head? <laughs> I don't like this. Hey, butter baby. Fuck it up for your pillow. <laughs> y'all like that, do y'all? <laughs> anyway, good morning. Top of the morning, you guys. It's Monday. Oh, did y'all enjoy your weekend? I was working all weekend, you guys. So, you know, it's pleasure and pain because bitch be tired. Bitch be tired. So, I got a slightly ignorant ass question. So, like, y'all just gotta forgive me this morning. I just got some on my heart. I just let it have to spark. I had to, you know, just let it spark and let it fly, you guys. Listen. What do I mean when a nigga be FaceTiming you like first thing in the morning and he be sitting on the toilet taking the shit? Like, what the fuck do that mean, y'all? Like, should I be feeling some type of way? Should I feel like he loved in me? Because niggas will hold, like, uh, to me, I feel like when niggas be in the bathroom, like, that's their personal time and shit. They be, that's when they be on Facebook. That's when they be replying back to shit in the inbox. Like, they be making little fucking phone transactions and shit and motherfucking paying bills. I feel like that's what, that's what their, their bathroom time is for. So I feel like, I don't know, like, I'm awesome door the explorer type of shit. I'm trying to explore the thoughts and the possibilities. Like, what the fuck do that mean? Because I'm not going to call nobody when I'm on the toilet. I'm dead serious to my heart. Like, what the fuck do that mean, y'all? Because I'm, I'm dead for serious. Like, a nigga got to be dead ass comfortable with you to call you while he in the bathroom, right? Am I reaching, bitch? Or do niggas just be calling bitches while they be on the toilet on the FaceTime? Because I'm, I'm like... Is you... Is you on the toilet? You want to call me later? Niggas just be chilling. I just be like, okay. We ain't perfect, but we damn close, I guess. Like... I don't know. I just don't want to read too much into, into that. If no, don't nothing need to be read into that. Y'all need to let me know because... Like, I'm telling you, like, my stepfather, Anthony, and shit like that, that nigga will hold his shit all fucking day. Like, niggas will not take a shit no fucking way, especially not no black man. They is not taking no shit. Stepfather, Anthony, I swear to God, he will run through the face and get off the bus. And he will have his newspaper behind him, like, watch out, Slim, watch out, Slim, watch out, Slim. And yeah, this nigga been calling us Slim. <laughs> It's like way back in the day. Watch out, Slim. Watch out. And yeah, I ain't even used to be funny as shit. Balling through the motherfucking door. Damn near crying. <laughs> like, Bogart is like, get the fuck, nigga. Like, I gotta use the bathroom. I gotta use the bathroom. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Like, on some real ass shit. I feel like if a nigga will sit there and hold they self all day. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying? Or the first thing in the morning, they in that joint. That, that's their place of tranquility and peace after a long, hard day or whatever. Like, if a nigga calling you on the phone, that shit, that, that means something, right? I'm, I'm who these hoes trying to be. They ain't getting no calls in the bathroom. So listen, all of my male followers, correct me if I'm wrong. Am I feeding too much into this? Is like a man's personal time in his in the bathroom. If he picks up the phone and calls a girl while he's in the bathroom, especially on a FaceTime and shit like that, just chillaxing and just you know cooling. Do that mean that he really like her? What that mean? What that mean? And, and like and like okay, if you dating somebody and like he he dead ass like why he taking the shit? Open up the door and be trying to like hold ass have a conversation like does like. When niggas, when niggas motherfucker want to communicate with you when he in his personal space in the bathroom, does that change the dynamic of a relationship? That's basically the question. Bitch. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm so ignorant. I'm sorry. Was this an ignorant ass question? I don't care. Because I ain't scared. I'm going to ask y'all what I, what's on my mind. 2.30 in the but y'all let me know. I'm going out here all stealth, all incognito out here with my shit, you know. Because niggas be trying, you know, jump out on the bush on the bitch and shit. I'm trying to tell y'all, y'all, ladies, you got to understand that there's responsibility out here when you got stalker level, poom poom, okay? When you be turning niggas into stalkers, okay? And they just be wanting to be all in your life, you know what I'm saying? 
because they thought she was nice and you was just talking to them. See, so that's why you can't get your poom poom to everybody because if they acting crazy and you ain't giving no poom poom, your girl, ooh, you, that nigga crazy. You, that nigga crazy. So y'all, y'all be out here still, you know what I'm saying? Y'all be having to do what y'all be having to do, you know what I'm saying? Have to, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you stay ready. If you stay ready, you ain't got to get ready out here on the nigga, you know what I'm saying? I'll let y'all.